Hey what is up guys in this video i'm going to show you a new method on how to connect your myopi slice to your android phone this will work on all android phones uh, that are on version android pi 9.0 and above and phones that are released in 2019 so firstly we are going to have to connect a uh, myopi slice to, to the charger and hold the and hold the button on it for about 7 seconds till it resets and don't leave the button till that 5 for 3 to 1 that countdown occurs now secondly we have to go into the play store and we have to install this pi research app don't worry if you do not see your myo pi app on the play store that is fine now we have to wait for the symbol to to be there on the band then uh, we have to sign up we have to enter all these details and we have to tick this box in the bottom as you can see i have already entered my details and now i am going to log in So after successfully logging in, you can see over here that they ask us how often do we work out. I work out once a week, and uh, am I and I and how hard do I train? I take it easy, and how long do I exercise? Until thirty minutes. Okay. Now click on next. Now here you can enter all your details. For example, your height, weight, your, your birthday, whether you are male, female, etc. RHR is resting heart rate and MHR is maximum heart rate. The the normal heart rate is usually 80 slash 120, so that is okay. As you can see, uh, it did not detect the device, so we have to go into Bluetooth first and cl click on Bluetooth manually, and then from here we have to cl click on pairing. Then we have to click on press me on the band, and as you can see, the device is finally connected. Then we can go ahead and open the app. And now here on top, you can see the device. So we'll go ahead and click on connect. Now we'll go ahead and click on allow. Now if we if we go down and click on anything, we can see that the device has still not been connected. It is showing a uh, out of range. But don't worry, we will fix that in a moment. we we can go ahead and do all these options we can click on left hand then enable all these sensors click on device brightness vibration etc etc then here this is a firmware update but as you can see the band will only update if the charge is about 30% or it is connected to the charger so as you can see now the device has been found and it is located this symbol will appear on the band and this will take about 5 minutes 5 to 10 minutes so now it is done if if you if you are just in detect you can just adjust it on the charger and it will work now finally as you can see over here it is still not connected but don't worry we will fix that in a moment all you have to do is is close your app and everything and then close everything so now firstly we we will go into bluetooth and we will click on connect to slice and we will open everything now as you can see the device has finally been connected it is showing the device information and and stuff and and don't worry it will show you your heart rate and stuff and and all the device information and it will also show a sync in progress which means that the device is working properly and everything is properly connected now this is a new feature in your band it will show the bas the battery percentage on your myopi slice band so thank you so much for watching